What's up guys, this is Caleb from Newbie Tech Company and uh, I got one more iCloud demo to show you guys. Uh, this one having to do with Reminders, which is the new application uh, for basically just a to-do list. Um, and I, I have a preview of that in my iOS 5 overview, so go ahead and check that out. I'll uh, create a link in the description, but uh, anyway, let's get to the demo. Um, so I have my MacBook over here my PC computer over here um, and then my iPod right here so what we're gonna do is on our iPod we'll go ahead and open up reminders which is right here as you can see I got a few reminders going on um, but we'll add a new one um, and show you well actually here before we add a new one I'll show you what I have so far in my computer so open up Outlook and Again, if you've seen any of my previous iCloud videos, you'll know that it syncs through Windows with uh, Outlook. So we'll go down to the bottom here and uh, click on Tasks. And over here I have a couple different tabs I can choose from, and we want to make sure we have Reminders selected. Um, and here are all my Reminders. Um, right here I have the four that are uncompleted. And as you can see, four of them there aren't checked off. And then if I go to my iPad and iPod and clicked on, whoops, and click on completed, I have four that are checked, and those are the same ones right there. Um, and then if we go ahead and go to my iCal on my Mac, you can see here. Um, let's see how did I do this? There's a way to get reminders. Preferences, Advanced, um, here's Settings for Reminders, uh, let's see, New Reminders, so I can get to all my reminders here, oh wait, View, and Show Reminders, okay, so, gotta figure it out, so over here are my Reminders, um, and then you can see the three, well maybe you can't see that, but there are three that are, or four that are unchecked and four that are checked, and those are all the same. Um, so all three of my devices are synced. Uh, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go into my iPod, and I'm going to create a new reminder. Um, so we'll go back, we'll hit the plus button, and we'll just type in some random words. Um, just one long string of random letters so hopefully guys you'll be able to recognize that and I can show you that it's actually working in real time so I'll hit return um, so now I've created that new new reminder and it's got just that long string of random letters uh, hopefully you guys can see that but I'll exit out and I'll lock my iPod and then we'll come over to my Windows computer and right away there it is that long string of random letters is there with the box unticked um, we'll take it real fast and show you guys how that works too in real time how fast it uh, syncs across each device um, and then we'll come over to my Mac and um, we will sort them by or not due date. Um, we'll sort by title. Um, and unfortunately, which is weird, we have no new notification or reminder um, on the Mac. So it shows up on the Windows, but doesn't show up on the Mac. That is very interesting. Um, and actually, no, it's not because. I'm not connected to Wi-Fi. <laughs> Alrighty, so let's see what happens as soon as I connect. Okay, so right now I'm connected. Let's see how long it takes to sync up. And there it is. So that was pretty much immediate. Um, that was my fault, guys. Sorry about that. I wasn't connected to the internet, but now that I am, it immediately shows up. So that was almost instant. Um, cool. Uh, so now let's go ahead, let's uh, check it on here. We'll just check it off and see how fast each device syncs up. So we'll check it. It is now completed. 
and we'll come over to the iPod. We'll go into reminders, and there's the random string of letters, and it just went away. So I'm guessing if we click on completed here. Yep, there it is. That random string of letters that you guys can barely see is all done, checked off. So that was pretty much immediate. Um, and then we head over to our Windows and Outlook, and there it is, still not checked off, but I believe what we have to do, um, at least in the beta, is to click on this iCloud refresh button, and when we hit that refresh, immediately it gets checked off. So that's, that random string of letters now checked off, it used to be up there, but now it's down there, so, um, yeah. I am fairly impressed with this. Uh, I wish it could be automatic on Windows, but I'm sure they're, you know, it's still in, in beta and they're working on it. So, uh, but yeah, I am very impressed with this uh, new reminders system. As long as your MacBook is connected to the internet, it's all automatic. So, um, yeah, that's uh, reminders in the iCloud. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Uh, be sure to stay tuned for more iCloud demos. I'll be filming them as more and more features be uh, get released. So. Uh, definitely stay tuned for that. Uh, this is Caleb from Newbie Tech Company. Thanks for watching.